What does recovery mean to you? Uh, that word means so many things. Um, recovery, well, recovery for me. I've, I've been in recovery for many years. I had my struggles. I have a lot of life experience. Recovery means amazing new possibilities to live out your dreams and have healthy relationships with those you love and care about. Simply means, let me be like everybody else. So for me, recovery is being able to live my fullest life every day with support and with love. The mission of the Mental Health Association of Westchester is to promote mental health through advocacy, community education, and direct services. When a person receives a mental health diagnosis, it's one of the most devastating and isolating kind of diagnoses that you can get. It's a very lonely place to be, and so the peer approach is that you have lived history which you bring into a relationship that is a relationship of equality. It's not that I know better than the participant that I'm working with, it's that I know. And that's where the power is because when they tell me that they don't want to leave the house, I know what that feels like. I spent three years in my apartment virtually and I know what it's like to be afraid to step out. That knowledge and that deep understanding that I have of that helps me to help someone get out the door. I think peer services matter because it's vital for every youth and every client to know that it's not just professionals telling them about their life, but for us to partner with them and for them to tell us what their goals are. We're giving people a place to feel heard and we're giving people permission to feel. At MHA, we're always meeting clients where they are, and I feel like it's really important to do the same with staff. Meet staff where they are around really serious incidents that are happening every day at work. CASAs are absolutely relentless in advocating for the needs of the children who they have been assigned to. Um, we are um, determined that the children get all the services that they deserve in school, uh, that they get their mental health needs taken care of, that they get their parental visits, that they get their sibling visits. Just about everybody has a story. And if we provide the opportunity for people to have conversation with us, we start to learn about those parts of people's lives that they've learned to keep hidden. There are so many times when life's challenges feel overwhelming and it feels that no end to those challenges is imaginable. But when we reach out, when we ask people what's happening in their lives, when we let them know that we notice their distress, we start to hear those stories. And in those moments, what we learn is that that little bit of connection demonstrates to people that they're not invisible, they're not alone, that connection is possible, that hope is possible, and that so much of the time, just that, just that is enough to turn the tide and help people decide that at least in the moment, life is possible and life is what they want to choose. And what we've also learned is that saving a life in the moment can be saving a life forever. You know, there's a notion that it's not our family members and our neighbors, but other people who have mental health issues. The more we talk to people, the more we learn that we're all having a shared experience um, and that we're all experiencing many of the same things. Issues that I might be having with my children are issues that you're having with your children. And so the more we talk about that and realize that we're not alone, it makes it easier to reach out for help and support, um, either formally or informally. Recovery means consistent and concerted effort towards being the best version of you. Recovery means everyone has an opportunity for their voice to be heard and for their feelings to be acknowledged and respected. Each person's goals or hopes may be different and recovery means meeting those for whatever that is for that person. Being kind to yourself and others. No, no longer struggling 
but more on point with their lives. That's what recovery means to me. I think recovery means creating a path, an individualized path, um, that promotes growth, self-discovery, and positive change. Recovery means, more than anything, hope. Recovery means that no matter what, you can always find self-love. And more than anything, recovery means that at any time, anyone can beat the odds. It's a wrap. <laughs> that was fabulous.